Hi, my name is Emilio and today I'm going to show you how I am restoring a um, image that we had saved to an external hard drive. We saved the original image to the external hard drive and we're going to restore this Macintosh that I booted from the original CD and right now we're going to get started here is uh, asking us uh, which language to use and we're going to click English and we're going to say continue now is going to give us the next screen at which point we're going to go to the menu up on the top in the menu we're going to select utilities within utilities we're going to click and we're going to select disk utility from disk utility it will give us an option to select which drive we want to restore obviously it's going to be the drive on this on this Mac and we're going to restore it from the image that is stored on this external hard drive. So now this uh, utility has started and we select the hard drive on this computer and we're going to say we want to erase it because we want to start from a fresh, uh, freshly erased drive and then we're going to say erase. It only takes a few seconds to erase it. It's asking us if we are sure we want to erase it. Yes, we are sure we want to erase it. Okay, so it erased the drive. Now we're going to say we want to restore. So we're going to select restore. And it's going to ask us for the image. Now the image is on the external drive. So we click that. And now this is where we put here the source which is going to be the original disk image and we're going to click here on image to look for it and now it opens up the window for the external drive and it, now that we are connected to the external drive I'm going to select the folder where the disk image is it's this disk image so I have saved two disk images so I'm going to select that one and I'm going to say open so now we see here that we selected the disk image from the external drive now the next box it says destination so where do we want to put the image where we want to put it so we're going to select the, the hard drive so we're going to click on the drive and we're going to drag it we're going to drag the drive to the box or the field that says destination and now we just click the button that says restore and it's asking us are you sure you want to restore and we say yes restore now it's starting to and you see that it's calculating how long it's going to take uh, it will probably take about an hour so when we come back we will reboot the computer and the original disk image will have been uh, installed on this uh, computer thank you for watching and um, I want to invite you to watch my videos. Thank you.
So it's just started and it's saying that it's going to take one hour and 26 minutes but that uh, initial setting uh, is a little bit high and it actually goes faster than that. So I'll come back and show you the progress as um, the receding continues. The disk image uh, copying continues, and right now it shows 35 minutes left to go. The image process has completed, and you can see there's nothing happening. Now what we're going to do is uh, we're going to restart the computer now that the image has been um, copied over from the external drive to the hard drive of this computer so all we need to do is uh, close the uh, disk utility and since we put it from from the um, CD we just need to quit the installer and we're going to say that we want to set the hard drive as the boot up hard drive to boot from the hard drive and we're going to restart So we want to select the hard drive. You will notice that the, there's the CD. We don't want to boot from the CD anymore. We did that already. Now here's the hard drive or if we want to boot from the network. So we're going to select the hard drive as the device to boot from and then we're going to click the restart button and he's asked us are you sure you wanna restart so we say yes and we just give it time to update all the changes and reboot so we're waiting for the computer to shut down it has shut down and now it's rebooting so this time the computer is uh, rebooting from the internal drive and we're looking at the monitor with the spinning circle we have just completed re-imaging the hard drive so it, this will be the first time that the computer is booting up it takes a few seconds longer and we're waiting for the hard drive to boot up So we got the uh, blue screen and there's the, the cursor and there's our desktop. And all of our applications are on the dock. So I can close uh, all of the uh, windows that are opening up. So this is the window for the uh, CD. I don't need that anymore. I can cancel. I can um, eject. 
the DVD, drag it to the trash, and the CD will be ejected. And our hard drive is now working. Thank you very much for watching.